Hello and welcome to another update video about Solana. Not too much happened. Solana is basically just trending down slowly. In my opinion, it looks like a corrective move to the downside. So not really impulsive yet. Doesn't give us any clues um, that it wants to break really below the first line of support. Remember what we said. We highlighted that Solana can still give us one more extension higher in wave three. And I'm going to follow that wave count until we break below $89.80. Um, surely, you know, Solana doesn't need that one more extension, but it is still a reasonable, let's say, interpretation as long as the support levels are holding. Basically, what we need to do, we need to be watching for potential reactions in this support zone to 97.33 uh, or at 97.33 or 89.80. I mean, these are the Fibonacci levels. Oftentimes we see reactions at these levels um, and as long as the price doesn't sustain below $89.80 which again is the 50% uh, retracement level of this third wave rally which started on the 13th of December and likely finished on Monday. Um, the 50% Fibonacci level is just a key level that you know if broken we normally say it's losing its impulsive potential so basically that indicates that any further trading on the long side at least it will be less clear and it could indicate that um, the chart is losing its impulsive potential in this particular extension yeah um, and that's at $89.80 so that doesn't mean if we break below it you know it doesn't mean it will be completely invalidated that it can, can go higher but the probabilities are strongly going to shift towards yep okay the top has formed and we are basically now in a larger correction. And that larger correction would be this larger degree fourth wave, basically, that we've been talking about um, already for a while, with now support between $47 and $79.34. And um, important to understand that at the moment, the price isn't giving us any indications that it wants to break below that critical support level. Of course, you know, I'm an analyst i am not a prophet i also can't tell you if support will hold or not but as long as the price is above support it kind of makes sense to go with a trend which is still up which will only break below 89 dollars and 80 um or start to break the move to the downside currently looks corrective so uh, again not impulsive so i've got a potential a wave complete potentially wave b is complete and this could be the c wave down it is entirely possible that the B wave extends a little bit here uh, in a wider flat, for example, because um, we haven't taken out the low of the A wave. So, and we only have three waves down. So it could simply be, um, you know, A wave bottomed here. That was on Tuesday, A, B, C in a wider B wave flat structure, which is a three, three, five move. And then the C wave down could happen later entirely possible um, because it's a wave four it allows for a wide variety of different patterns for example also triangles so the wave four could unfold as a triangle but i don't see any evidence for a triangle here so essentially we just need to be a little bit patient watch the support levels and i mean a break above this micro resistance area here you know these previous swing highs really looking at the microstructure here at 117 dollars and 30 roughly could indicate that the downtrend is over the local downtrend and that the wave five to the upside is unfolding with the next Fibonacci levels being $134.79 and $147.47. So essentially today, these are the levels to watch for today and the coming sessions. Um, above that level, we are dealing with the, well, the Fibonacci extension levels to the upside. The 1.618 extension is basically the previous high 825.60 and the move above that can send the price to 134.79 which is the 1.786 extension and the 147.47 level which is the 200% extension. So that's still what we need to consider. Um, these are the parameters that are relevant for this fifth wave extension. It's a short-term bullish scenario before that larger degree fourth wave starts. If the larger degree fourth wave has started already you know, we, we can't tell yet. We need to see further confirmations for that. That's my update about Solana. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, 
then please check out the channel membership. Also, make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.